What are you doing? Mm, I'll be honest with you. I thought that these little handcuffs will look cute on your wrist. <laughs> when I bought them, I was like, oh, my sweetheart, my cute little puppy. Wearing these silver handcuffs and I just wanted to put them on you. <laughs> I wanted to put them on you to let you know that you messed up. You messed up so badly. You know when you've been caught and you get read your Miranda rights and then they say, you know, you can get a lawyer and you're taken away for the crime you committed? Well, you committed a crime, a very, very bad crime. Your little honey right here had a long day and all I wanted was to eat my grandma pizza slice. But then I come home early. I don't see it in the fridge. Unless in my check, we don't have a pet animal. So I know our fake imaginary dog didn't eat it. Meaning you ate it. You ate my sweet tomato sauce with some mozzarella cheese and garlic and basil pizza slice that I was craving the whole day. I got annoyed. I went to that store, you know, the forbidden store, and I said, I need the ugliest pair of handcuffs. Mm. The guy smiled. He didn't even ask me why. He just knew that I was going to use it. <laughs> it was pretty obvious because if you were going to use those handcuffs on me, they would be the prettiest one, not the ugliest one. The ugliest one is for somebody who needs a punishment, and that's you. I paid, came home, and now they're on you because you're going to repent. And you're going to struggle. And I love seeing you struggle. <laughs> right now, you're pretty okay. Right? Because the beginning. It's like when you go to your work and you're having an okay day. Eh, the first hour of your job, okay. By the time you reach the middle of it, you want to go home. You want to get out of your job. Because you can't take it anymore. You pushed past your limit. And I know you always say, you can take anything. <laughs> I have no limit. And I really wonder if that is true. And while you're handcuffed, I'm going to sit right over here. In this comfy chair, far away from you. I'm going to play with my watermelons. My lovely juicy watermelons that are so yummy. And I'm going to take this. This hard jelly banana looking thing. And you know where it's gonna go. It's gonna go very, very deep in that tunnel. The tunnel that my lovely caveman will never explore because he decided to touch something that was not his. My pizza. My grandma pizza. My poor grandma. I want to eat my grandma, not you. Only I get a taste of that lovely grandma slice. Okay? So sit back and relax because I think you know me at this point. I don't like playing around so much. I like to end things quickly. But if I have to, oh, I will make it last. 
I will make everything last until you beg me and tell me you're sorry. Which, um, let's see. I won't listen. <laughs> you're in for a long afternoon. A very long, mm, actually not afternoon, a very long evening. <laughs> and don't worry, I know what you're going to try to do afterwards. And I am always prepared. Don't worry, I know your feet can do stuff, but your feet are soon to be under my spell. So be patient. Be nice and reflect on every bad thing you did today, okay?